All right, finally, we saw the Prime Minister juggle One Nation preferences before finally pledging to put the party below Labor on how to vote cards. But it's revealed a split within the coalition with the Nationals still open to the idea of some Nationals very much putting One Nation before before Labor. Ron Boswell, I want to go to you first on this because you, you know, you're often quoted to me actually by colleagues still in the parliament as the, as the one who led this push to get rid of One Nation, to put them last, to take them on. Are you disappointed your party's not taking a stronger position? Well, I'm very pleased that the Liberal Party have uh, adopted the position to put One Nation last, uh, well not last, but below Labor. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm hopeful that the National Party haven't made, a, uh, haven't made a final decision yet. I'm hopeful that they will. Uh, what happens when you get into the preferences with One Nation? You lose your moderate vote. Your moderates, when you preference One Nation, your moderates just leave you in droves and the Conservatives think it's probably all right to go and vote um, uh, for One Nation Direct. So you get caught in a pincer movement and you lose both ways. Uh, there's only one way to take One, uh, take one Nation on, is explain the policies. Go out there, treat Pauline Hanson uh, credibly, as she has won a seat in the parliament, and she deserves to be uh, treated well. But explain the policies. Citizens Initiative referendum, wonderful. Except uh, the first thing you'd lose would be live cattle. Uh, the second would be kangaroo culling. And, and, and who do you want to negotiate your live cattle uh, in uh, Indonesia? Do you want Pauline Hanson sitting across from Wadodo? Or do you want someone that's uh, credible? So, Ron Boswell, Explain have, you the been, policies. have you been saying to your party, I imagine you contact people, talk to people, put One Nation after Labor? Well, my, my um, position on this is very clear and very consistent and has been so for four or five years. Yes, that's my position. And you've told Michael McCormack you think this? Uh, I've told people in the National Party, of course I have. Have you convinced any of them? Well... At, at the moment, they're, 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 they haven't locked down their position. So you still think you might be successful with some of them? I'm, I'm trying. I am trying.